businesses and restaurants along the Boston Marathon route always get a big boost from the race. As WBZ's Tiffany Chan shows us, there's a new twist this year which will drive more runners into restaurants. Lots of changes this Marathon Monday, including the season that it's being held on and also no linguine for runners. Instead of the pasta dinner held every Sunday before the marathon, the BAA is encouraging athletes and their families to try something different this year. The folks at Sam Adams are asking marathon runners to embrace new traditions. We just want to make this one an extra special celebration. Instead of carving out on pasta at City Hall the night before the big race, organizers are urging people to support bars and restaurants along the 26-mile route. Oh, madness, always. It's a, it's a nonstop party. Cameron LeBeck is the manager of MJ O'Connor's in Boston, not far from the finish line. The three-day festivities allows them to bounce back after a rough 2020. Of course, yeah, no, it's, it's always exciting to get that sort of big rush and have uh, business sort of boom back up again. Um, it's an adjustment for all of us. It's always been one of our busiest days of the year. West of the city in Natick, Morse Tavern has front row seats to the runners. It's right here. I mean, it's within feet away from the actual marathon, so we're super excited about having everybody return. But they really depend on the spectators, their business to stay afloat. That's why this year's marathon and its push to support local restaurants is so meaningful to the staff here. Oh, it's like life reborn. I mean, it's really something. We're so excited about it. The staff is super excited to start making money again. I mean, it was really hard for them. It was hard for all business owners. But it's nice to see their enthusiasm. It's nice to see all the guests come back and get super excited about something fun to enjoy. From Boston, I'm Tiffany Chan for WBZ News. Tiffany, thank you. For the first time, the BAA will be holding an opening ceremony for the race. That's tomorrow night at 6, and we will stream it live on CBSN Boston. And WBZ is proud to be your Boston Marathon station. The 125th running is Monday. Our coverage starts with WBZ this morning at 4.30 a.m. Stay with us for the pre-race show at 7, and the first athletes take off earlier this year at 8 a.m.